everyone, we are back with Clan Velvet Reviews today, and I am going to start filling up my 60-gallon uh, breeder with some water. That's just tap water. I'm just, right now, all I want to do is I want to check out the cabinet strength a little bit. Um, I already, you already saw my other video, I put like a thousand pounds on here, and this is not really going to weigh a thousand pounds, so I re but I just want to see, uh, you know, uh, the cabinet's reaction, um, you know, uh, with the new legs that I did put on, if you saw that, I put new legs on the, on this cabinet to level it out easier. We're going to dump it in five gallons at a time, I'm going to mark it so we know, you know, five gallons in this, just in case you get a, um, 60 gallon breeder, if you decide to get one, you'll know, um, you know. Because usually people just fill it up. I just filled mine up. I didn't really care. Um, so I'm, uh, since I have time and I'm waiting and I'm doing this slow because it's going to be a little bit more expensive than my 40-gallon breeder. So I'm doing it kind of slow right now. So since I'm doing it slow, I'm going to do this little test. Check out the... and do it with you guys. Check out how this thing, this cabinet feels. And what I also did, um, I couldn't get all of it, but I put 10 gallons uh, inside here. So that's about 100 pounds uh, almost 100 pounds of water I put in here. I tried to fill it up more, but uh, I ran out of RO water, so I didn't get to test that. So it's only about 10 gallons in there. And then in here, uh, I have salt that's about um, 50 pounds back there. I have salt that's like 50 pounds in the back there. And then I'm going to also put um, probably just five gallons of water uh, just because my sump is going to be there. So I'm trying to just simulate the, um, you know, the weight uh, just to, um, you know, make sure it's okay and everything like that. Because this, this is Ikea. I didn't build this myself. So that's the only reason I am, you know, uh, just testing it out with uh, the weight parameters that I got going on. So, uh, yeah, that's kind of it right now. So we're going to dump the water in, see what's up. This is uh, six quarts right here. Okay. And then this is 14 quarts. So, so far this is five gallons. So I'm gonna mark that off on there. Oh, it got pretty high with five gallons, right? Ooh, look how cool it looks. Um, look at this. I love this breeder. This is such a sexy tank. I'm very happy about it. It's fucking awesome. Um, so yeah, I know I would go bigger in a dream tank, but they came out with this and I'm so happy with the hype because I have back surgery issues. And uh, I can reach in here. I just feel more confident with this having than a, a higher tank where I have to get a step stool. And you know, I'm little, so it's, it's a pain in the butt. So let's, let me mark off over there. Alright, so uh, I put a total of, let's see, so this is the scale that I made, uh, so I put a total of 5, 15, 20, you know, whatever, uh, 50 gallons is the total I put in there, so uh, 50 gallons goes right up to the tip here, so you're probably going to put like, what, 52, 53, maybe, you know, something like that, I mean, I don't know if you do 55, because 55 would probably go like right to here. Uh, so I just put 50 in here 55 would probably go like right to here if you're gonna put it that high um, Just to show you guys, but right now 50 is in it and you can't see uh, any of the line So just to show you with 50 gallons you can't see the line, but it's right on this line at 50 gallons So if it loses like eight ounces, you're gonna see it um, So yeah, that's about it. So right now we have what a uh, 40 gallon breeder full is 460 pounds This right now should be roughly about 600 pounds on top of this and just to let you guys know that when I did put in about 250 pounds, um, I guess, you know, 25, when I was at like 25 gallons in here, roughly, um, and plus all the weight in there, I had to adjust the levels. Uh, I put my level on and definitely uh, some stuff moved around because it was completely level before I, I even put the weight in it. And then once I put it in, I had to use the level and re-level everything. This side, I mean, the front of it dropped down an eighth of an inch. When I put all the weight on, about about an eighth of an inch, I would say uh, it moved, uh, you know, towards the front or whatever. So um, that could have been because I didn't have all the nuts. Uh, the nuts that go here that I showed you guys in the video, I didn't secure all the nuts. Could have been because of that. So right now, I leveled it out with all the weight in it leveled out all these legs properly and then I put the nuts uh, back up into there so this way it's you know be 
designed uh, for the weight and stuff like that. That's about it for Glen Velvet reviews uh, on me just, you know, filling it up and just checking for leaks and showing you guys, you know, just keeping you guys updated while I go on with this thing, um, this little project here. Um, if you have any questions or comments, please post them down below. I would love to know. Also, subscribe to my channel. Join me on my review adventures as I try to put up stuff to help out the community, just like I can help from the community. All right, everybody enjoy. Be safe. I'm out. Bye-bye.